Christmas lights from the John the Lighting. So right there, that's the power plug. And then right there, that is the remote receiver. Receiver receiver. Got the mini LED Christmas light, 66 feet. A remote and instructions. The remote does come with a battery already pre-installed. Has a little plastic tab that goes between the battery and where the battery makes connection. So, you know, of course you pull that. And it's the controls so of course we did not read the instructions at all we, we didn't read the instructions at all but what we did do is we went ahead and installed these lights for you guys because i'm doing this for the fam so you can see the lights and actually now that you can buy a quality product from a black owned company whether you're black or white or other you feel me and know that you're getting some quality that will will stand the test of time no, and it does have some dope features, so we kind of messed around a little bit and just gonna see how I was supposed to unravel it without uh, tearing it up. So we'll fast forward past this part. So, to help mount it, I'm using these coaxial cable tie downs. I already had these, so. You can kind of see the little snippet, but we're going to get to work. Installment, and we'll check back in. So just to show you guys how long this is, I went down the side of the house. I originally was gonna run it down the side of the house of the lights. And I just want to see how long this was. The six six feet is a lot of feet. Take a look at that. Take a gander. So yeah, that's plenty. And yeah, I did change clothes. Uh and don't mind my belly fucking now. I do need to get back in shape. So Marcus, uh, yeah, we're probably gonna reconvene. But I did. It, it got hot. It got warm. Going up and down, going up and down. It got warm. But we made it work. Alright, family. So I did try to clean up the audio as much as I could going forward. Um, I was recording. And I was kind of moving back and forth from the mic, but I do go through all the steps, so please do pay attention. Uh, I think you'll like what you're going to see. That's what you like. So these are the LEDs. As you can see, they're plenty bright in my time. Work great. You have several buttons on here, 1 through 11. You also have two timers, 6-hour timer, 8-hour timer. Then a 6639. All right, so I spoke with the CEO and founder of Jama Lighting, and the 6639H stands for six hours on, six hours off, three hours on, nine hours off, which is 24 hours in a day. So it makes sense. But you have <laughs> dimming and brightening features. You can dim the lights. So you can make it nice, not so, so bright. You can bring it back up. So, this is number one. It alternates. Multiple colors. And then it also kind of fades in. And then it alternates. And then it fades in and alternates. So, number two. I'm dreaming of a white. Christmas, yeah. Number three, the traditional look. That's what we're accustomed to. Number four, it's like a alternate version of that. And if 
Yeah, of course, when I'm editing it, I know she can't see me. Carry on. You're looking at me, you see I'm having to afford the remote towards the module, to the receiver, right? Dang and Number five, there's a brighter version of that. Number six, phase between white, the alternate color versions and the traditional uh, color. So you have some customization kind of, and I don't want to say customization, but you got some, some variables. You can work with some things. You got some features, you know what I mean? You feel me? Number seven, it's kind of like steps, almost like ticket, tick, tick, tick. So once again, I, I was ticking. I was, I was, I was low key getting. I was tick, 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 tick. tick. Yeah, you know, I was getting. It. Continue the video. Number eight. Probably not gonna be a fan favorite. Uh, I'm about to issue a flash warning. You will see it by now. Nine. Same thing, just in the traditional colors. Yeah, I don't like, I don't like it. I don't like myself. I'm getting older. Number ten. Bright. Dark. Bright. And dark. And then number eleven. They kind of like that pulsate, uh, uh, like it'll take that damn, uh, uh, uh. so yeah, you have plenty of functionalities with this. Um, shout out to Rob, I, I hit him up, I let him know that um, I was doing this, and he said it's okay for the plug to be outside as long as it doesn't get submerged in water. So, if a little bit of water gets on it, you should be good, uh, especially if you use an outdoor outlet, the correct type of outlet that has the covers and all the additional seals and stuff around it. And of course, we do have a timer. You can turn the timer on, and when you do, you'll see it turn red over here. Let's bring you in. Turns red when you have the timer on. Timer off, so you know that's activated. It's like, oh wait, why the lights were on? Well, did you see the timer? That's the timer. Is there really a six hour, six thousand six hundred thirty nine hour timer? Sheesh. I mean, I'm gonna do six. I ain't, ain't leaving all night. And then I like. I think I like number two. What's number two? Number three. It's number six. I like number six. And then we're gonna dim it. Six, then we're gonna dim it. Make it do what it do. So, yeah, number six is what I like. And, um, yeah, be sure to hit the link below, grab you some. And, yes, these are modular, so you can't add more lights. So, if this is not enough, which look at it, it's not enough. You can add more lights. I'll be sure to hit the link below. Get you some and support the channel, and also I'll be getting some more myself. Just show you how to properly connect them, and then we're gonna run them, run it through again, show you that it works. Shout out to you, John Malina. Peace, and Black and Calm.